Good morning YouTube, this is Sergeant Foos and today I'm gonna quickly show you my latest evil portal. So I've made a new portal and the reason for that uh, is just because I want to give you a new one and an update. I learned a couple things uh, in the meantime and since my last uh, video I also have to say I lost the one I demoed in the video so that's a bit awkward but it is the way it goes. Um, I was in a hotel back then on a different laptop and somehow I managed to lose the portal I made in the video. But anyway, it's not that hard to make one as you can see in the video. So I also set up a give it up page, uh, Sergeant Foo's Evil Portals and I call this the Foo's Evil Portals. Um, at the moment there's only one uh, with a little bit of instructions. I do have to mention it only works on version 1.0.2 and it's not that 1.1.1 uh, the, the, the portal is not uh, uh, able to work on 1.1.1 but the thing is that the guys from Hack5 are struggling at the moment with the 1.1.1 and also in the beta I did a test yesterday they fixed a bug where one of the buttons wasn't showing they fixed that but it still has issues so uh, if you want to use my portal or any portal I think at the moment uh, you're safe on version 1.0.2 I also put a link button in here uh, it's very simple so here you have a screenshot uh, I call it the Ziggo uh, evil portal um, and it's because in the Netherlands we have uh, an ISP it's called Ziggo it's the largest one in the Netherlands and the funny thing is that uh, every client of Ziggo they receive a modem and the modem by default broadcasts two Wi-Fi SSIDs one unique one for the client and one called Ziggo which is an open hotspot and every client of Ziggo can walk near your home scan for Wi-Fi find it and connect to it and when they log in with their email and password that they received or registered from Ziggo they have internet access not many people use it, at least not many people I know, but when you're in an airport or at a train station it might be good fun to open this uh, in the Netherlands even if you're not a, a native uh, Dutch speaker just open this. When people are scanning for Wi-Fi they just look for hey can I find something so I'm not sure if you guys are able to see my window but as you can see uh, with networks there's one called Ziggo it's open and that's how it looks in the Netherlands so they click on it the evil portal will redirect you to the uh, to this captive portal and on an iPhone it looks like this unfortunately although you just saw my iPhone uh, I can't disconnect because that would uh, lose connection for streaming to OBS studio but it, uh, that's why I made screenshots so it, you would uh, jump you would get redirected to this page sometimes it takes a while so just make sure uh, and the phone also has mobile data so sometimes it hops in between the two uh, there's a wiki page here not much on it except some screenshots so what the user is tempted to do enter his uh, username and password and press in login which means login or connect in the, in Dutch and of course they will never su succeed they will get this page and uh, they might enter all of their passwords I know just many people are very simple people including myself I have one email address and like 10 passwords and I sometimes get tempted to enter all 10 of them that being said when you're in your evil portal make sure you have version 1.02 in the left top corner uh, go to manage get available modules install the evil portal uh, from newbie the first time opening it asks you to uh, install some dependencies as well make sure to do that and then when you're back uh, your portal library will be empty there's a program called filezilla which is also highlighted in the instructions on the github so the usage in here you can use filezilla with the download link when you open that and you connect uh, so host uh, 172.164.2.1 that's default for everybody username root that's also default password that's the one you gave the pineapple at the first setup and then the port number is 22 
and it will bring you into on the right side you will see the the storage of your pineapple so when you install the module there's a folder added to your pineapple called portal so it's in root root portals and in my case I already have to but if you don't you go to my github page on the top right you see the code button you say download zip extract extract the zip um, and then when you do that you will receive this uh, these four things might be more in the future but when you go to portals um, you get my Ziggo login in there I also have a bunch more from internet but uh, the Ziggo one and just make sure you upload the entire folder so not just the assets and the screenshots and stuff just the, the whole thing uh, when you are in the folder here so make sure your it says root portals then go on the left and say upload and then in this page this uh, refresh button doesn't work on 1.0.2 so make sure to hoop out by going in here somewhere and come back now it will refresh and it will find it just make sure to say active and then you have a preview window uh, the moment you start the web server the middle button in here you have a preview window and you should be able to go make sure to say uh, start in the top uh, so the server is actively running one other thing you need to make sure of go in settings and then in networks make sure your open access point is set to Ziggo the channel is not really important but one gives you the best coverage because channel 1 is on a lower frequency and the range will be a little bit better make sure it's not hidden and then also make sure your country is Netherlands because we have channel 13 all right that's about it um, I hope you guys enjoy this uh, I might disable comments on the YouTube but there's many ways to find me I'm on the hack 5 portals uh, on, the, on the forums uh, I'm you can uh, ask uh, if you have an issue in here just make sure it's related to my portal not to the uh, to the pineapple itself uh, please post those things on the hack 5 forums which you can also find the link in here so if you have uh, hack 5 forums that's where you post your issues uh, related to the pineapple but if you have suggestions or you'd like to have a new video about how to make uh, one of these yeah feel free um, there's one little disclaimer for this video I reused Clio's uh, evil portal so Clio thumbs up for you to post the portals uh, people can also find the link to yours in my video and underneath my video you guys thank you very much for watching uh, I hope you enjoyed and uh, yeah I really hope uh, to see or speak to you in the future thank you very much